beautiful coat. I would like to start with a beautiful coat. Every time I light up a cigarette, they're saying that the life is not worth living. I'm going to talk about the temperance of smoking. First, what is smoke? I mean temperance. Temperance is a practice of controlling the thoughts which are not good for health. First, what is smoking? Smoking is the act of inhaling and exhaling the fumes of burning primary heels. The body of inflammatories are smoked, including marijuana, but the act is most commonly associated with tobacco, as is in cigarettes, cigar, and pipe. Tobacco smoke contains of many chemicals, but the most commonly is nicotine, car, carbon dioxide, and carbon dioxide. These are highly addictive. According to the WHO, in 1990, approximately 4 million deaths per year and gradually increased to 5 million in 2003 and 6 million in 2011 and was expected to reach 6 million by year 2030. Now, let's move on. Now, let's see how it affects our health. The carbon monoxide, which is present in the tobacco, while the smokers smoke, it enters the lungs. After it goes to the lungs, it enters the bloodstream. In the bloodstream, there are many RBC cells. The job of RBC cells are transferring oxygen to the body. Therefore, when smokers smoke, they highly accumulate more carbon monoxide, which displaces oxygen in the body. Now, let's see the few diseases. Few diseases such as all types of cancer, especially mouth cancer and lung cancer. And lung disease and heart disease and heart disease affects on humans. Now let's see what is passive smoking. Passive smoking is is inhaling from other people's cigarettes. Hey man, why do you need to die from your cigarette? Mm -hmm. <laughs> so, about twenty percent to thirty percent estimate forty one thousand deaths per year. Children get affected by passive smoking, and children are most susceptible to get affected by passive smoking because it, it causes them to wheeze, cough, and sneeze, and their lungs are still little. Now, let's see the health benefits of quitting smoking. The first one is reduces the risk of cancer, heart function returns to normal, improvement in blood circulation, and improvement in lung function. And finally, here comes the important part. Without this, the speech cannot be completed. I would like to quote some Bible verses. The first verse is 1 Corinthians chapter 10, I mean chapter 6, verse 19 and 20. Your body, your body is the, your body is the Holy Spirit who is in you, received from God, not your own. Time for Honor God with your body. The second verse I'm going to tell is 1 Corinthians chapter 10, verse 31. Whatever you do or whatever you drink or whatever you eat, do it for the glory of God. Can you honestly say that smoking is for the glory of God? Thank you for everyone for letting me participate in this contest. May you all have a blessed day. Amen. Amen.